Hi everyone, how are you? Today I'm going to do a bag collection video. I know it's been really a long time since I did one. What I'm going to do today is show you that all the designer handbags that I have in my collection, I have them all around me. Uh, I'm going to show you year by year what I bought because I bought some, sold some. If you check my last bag collection video, you will see there will be a huge difference. Uh, change maybe so uh, I haven't shown featured all my handbags every single time that's why it will be like one time you might think there are a lot of things I'll go by year so the first bag that is staying in my collection for a very long time which I'm no, not planning to send it anytime anywhere is this a Prada it's called the East West tote this bag is, I purchased this in Neiman Marcus. I think this one was purchased 2010. So think how long I have had it. I really love this bag. I keep all these papers so to, to uh, give it a shape. So it's really, really spacious. It has all these, um, the huge space in between. And then it has like two popper, the button to and make it uh, bigger, like give more space. Then there are two side pockets, one and then I simply love the, 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 call, the closer, the zipper or whatever that is. This one, the buttons, that's really, really sturdy. So it can be carried hand, hand carry and also it has a shoulder strap. This is such a lovely bag. So like I said, this I bought at end of 2010. So the next bag that I'm going to show is a uh, Tory Birch. This one I just purchased it because uh, I love the Speedies, the Louis Vuitton Speedies, I love them. But some, somehow the Louis Vuitton Speedies never worked for me because the zipper, <clears throat> the zipper is so short that it's always difficult for me to put my hand inside and take things out of it. So there are three sizes, right, in 30, 25, 30 and 35, I have them kind of in other designer handbags. So, this is in the size of uh, Speedy 35, I mean comparing to Speedy 35 is the same size. But the good thing about this is the zipper kind of goes still here, so it kind of gives it a wide opening, which I really love. So this was a, actually a limited edition, I purchased this in 2011 maybe, 11 or 12, I'm not really sure when. So this is a bag. So funny that when I take this bag, whenever I go anywhere, people like, oh my god, it's so beautiful, where did you buy? They keep on asking me questions. The next one that I'm going to show you, I haven't featured it, but I purchased the one that I'm going to show you in 2013, last year, July. I remember it so well because I went right after the Independence Day purchase them. That is one of the beautiful thing I ever purchased which is my Chanel uh, Jumbo. This is a bigger one. The Jumbo, not, not the real bigger one, but the Maxi is the bigger one. This is the medium size I think. And then there is a medium, that's a smaller version to this. But anyway, this is a Jumbo. This is the double flap. It goes like this. This is a caviar leather with gold hardware. It is. It has this a double flap, and then it goes like that. <clears throat> it's nice. I can do a review later, but this is just to show you uh, my bag collection. So this I really love, and you see the sound still. I haven't used it that much. I think that's like um, as new as it is. Now there's a back pocket. This is a very sturdy leather. I got this from Saks Fifth Avenue. I love this bag so much. So the next bag is a Speedy 25 Amprant leather. Uh, this is color RR, I think. I've been eyeing this bag for so long, but I, I go to the store, I see it and come back. But then one fine day, I just thought I would buy. This I purchased last year in um, December, November, December, October, that time frame. So it's like that. Like I said, I have a lot of things inside because to keep its shape. So such a beautiful bag. It is, this is a Speedy 25. It gets heavy times, but it depends upon how many things you put in that. 
that also is there. But, um, the next one is my Alma BB. This I featured in a what's in my bag. I got this October, right all in the same like two months away or something. This is an Alma BB. This is like black with black hardware. Um, this is a limited edition I think. So, this is, I, I really really love this bag. Okay. The next one is my Luminous. This I got for during the Christmas time. This is the one. This is in color Infini. This is a discontinued uh, color. They have they brought it in black, complete black. This looks like black, but it's actually they call it like navy blue. So like that. This is my Luminous. I adore this bag. I just adore it. It's such a classy bag. The next one is a coach. This I bought Jan or 2014. This one. I just went to the coach outlet and I saw it is really nice because it has two huge big pockets and then in between in middle there is a pocket which you can carry like a wallet or anything. It's such a nice bag. You can throw it's like this Mary Poppins bag. You can keep on throwing things into it and it can take it. Such a beautiful bag this one is. So this is in color, I think it's um I don't know, it's like looks like purple. It might be purple. The next one is my Balenciaga, which is this. This is a Chrome Messenger bag. I got this in Feb 2014, this year. Um yep. This one, it's really spacious, it's really nice that you can uh, carry crossbody, it's really really good. It has undergone a lot of the whole winter. I carried this, I love it. And then next is my Celine Micro Micro bag, which I got in March or April 2014 this year. This is a micro one because I'm not a huge fan of hand carry, so I looked, looked at mini, but that is too huge. I felt this is a pebbled leather. Pebble leather because pebble leather doesn't get scratched that easily. I heard so I, I go I, I went with this and um, this is a beautiful bag. It has like feet and it's like a small bag. It's cute. The next one that I have is my Burberry. Um, this is um, I got this year like after that May maybe for my birthday. Now this bag is compared. To, is equivalent to a speedy 30 30 size okay and it's nice I really like this print I was actually having second thoughts about it but my husband said my husband usually doesn't know much designer anyways but he said oh, that's a beautiful beautiful bag whose brand is that so I thought okay now this this I should keep because he recognizes that so that was good I really love I really really love this bag it's nice and then the next one is, so May I bought, that's in May, then June, July, I just left this month, I kind of went uh, bag crazy, I think. Uh, I got a Philip Lim um, Mini Pashley, this is some in brown uh, with gold hardware, I really like it. I'll tell you, this bag can hold everything in it, this bag can hold insulate wallet many things I can just keep on adding things into it and it takes it it is such a beautiful bag I love it so it's like a hand carry and also you can wear it on the shoulder or as a crossbody strap the last one the last one is so the last thing that I purchased is my Givenchy I hope I spell it right I'm not really sure Antigona here this is in black with silver hardware and this is like black uh, pebble leather. Like I said, I'm a huge fan of pebble leather because I feel they are indestructible. I got this. This is such a beautiful bag. I'm telling you, you have seen, you saw how many bags I have, right? I mean, not much, but still I kind of like brought it down. 
I sold many. The reason I have a couple things is I sold from my previous collection. I sold most of the things from there. And then I got couple and I sold many of my wallets and everything. I did a lot of different change to my collection. I have only the bags which I really, really use. If not, I just um, sell them or do something with it. Sell them mostly. So this bag, this has been with me for two weeks. Everywhere I go, it gets compliment. I don't buy bags to get compliments, but this bag is like a head turner or something. It grabs the attention. It's such a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful bag. I love it. And then it has, it's very spacious inside. Actually, I have to show you this. You see this one? This is um, Salvatore, like Ferragamo wallet. This black with uh, silver hardware. And this goes like black with silver. It kind of matches. I really, really love it. So this is the purchase that I made. This is the latest one. So these are my bag collection. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, leave comments below and let me know if you have any questions. Alright, bye.